Attorney Tim Lewis gets five times the original offer for our injured client. Hi, I'm Shane from Shane Smith Law. I'm here with one of our attorneys, Tim Lewis. We want to talk about another client victory we have where uh, Attorney Lewis was able to get a great settlement result for our client, TR. Um, Tim, tell me about TR's case and, and what was going on with it when, when they retained it. What happened? Uh, TR was an uh, elderly gentleman, about 67 years old. He was uh, T-bone uh, on the driver's side door. Uh, ex and he um, experienced really serious injuries. Uh, he had herniated disc and um, bulging disc and every vertebrae in his, in his neck. It's wow. recommended for, it's recommended for uh, the cervical fusion surgery. Um, and the insurance company uh, felt like since he had, that was an existing injury, they felt like they gave us a really low offer. Uh, they offered us 20000 on the 100 policy on the case. Okay. And, and so what happened after that? So basically, it sounds like they said he's older. His spine wasn't perfect. We think some of these herniations may have been there before. They recommended, the doctor recommended surgery. Uh, we, we sent it over to them. They said no, gave us a low offer. What happened next? Well, at that point, um, I constructed a, a very carefully crafted bad faith letter letting them know that uh, our client was, a, was an eggshell plaintiff meaning that the, um, the tort fees must take him as they found him. And they found him as a elderly gentleman who had undergone uh, uh, prostate cancer, uh, kidney cancer, uh, and he had uh, congestive heart failure surgery. He could not undergo the cervical fusion surgery for his neck. Uh, it would just be too much on him. And he was uh, already in hospice at the time, uh, shortly after the accident. And uh, just made them see that uh, by refusing him by holding that against him, that he had all these pre-existing conditions, uh, they were acting in bad faith. Okay. And so basically he's on his last, you know, he's nearing the, the tail end of his life and, and they made it worse by the accident. So exactly. that they were needed surgery. I'm assume that that increased his pain, you know, hurt a lot much more. Uh, the, the last little bit clearly was more uncomfortable than it, than it should have been. Um, you wrote your bad faith letter. What happened? Did they did they pay? Did they make you go to court? What happened there? Um, about two weeks after I submitted the bad faith letter, uh, we had a, we had an offer for the policy limits. Wow. Um, okay. They, they tended five times their original offer, which of course was one hundred thousand. All right. So they so they came in with a low offer. You responded, said, "Hey, basically, our we got an eggshell plaintiff. He was injured before, and they tendered the policy limits, all the money." Exactly. Yes. All right, that sounds like a wonderful result for uh, as good a result as you could get for Mr. TR. Obviously, you would prefer not to be in the accident um, and to be healthy. What was something you learned on this case that you can use on future cases? Well, uh, just the, the, the power of, of a well-crafted bad faith letter, uh, even though we had a, about 14,000 in, in medical bills, um, with, again, the original offer being 20, um, just with the well-crafted bad faith letter, uh, within two weeks later, we had, a, we had a full policy limit offer. Well, that's a great result for TR. Best result you could get him, I guess. Uh, congratulations on policy limits offered. That's a uh, great result on this particular case, especially once it's five times the original offer. So great work there is what I would say. Thank uh, you. To our, to our listeners, that's another client victory here at Shane Smith Law. Um, remember, if you're in pain, call Shane, 980-999-9999, or find us online at www.shanesmithlaw.com. Be going over another client victory next week from one, another one of our attorneys here at Chainsmith Law. Nine eight zero nine 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 nine. Nine eight zero nine 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 nine. Chainsmith Law.